Hello adventurers and welcome to the Great Salt Plains State Park where we are going to go and find some crystals today. I am so excited. I've been out here before. I've done another video, but today there's been a lot of moisture. So we're going to see what we can find with the ground being so wet and you're coming with me. So let's get out here and dig. Now joining me today on the adventure is my dad. Dad came with me the last time also, and we found some really big crystals. So what we're doing right now is we're actually sifting through one of the piles that somebody else left because a lot of times people leave behind all sorts of things and don't realize it. So right now, dad has the sifter out and let's see if we can find something awesome. And then after that, we're gonna actually dig in and start trying to find some crystals out of the ground itself. Now, the way that this works is really simple. You just need a few things. You need your hands, maybe a shovel, and possibly some water. Water is actually present right now already, so we're not having to bring that with us. So what we're gonna do is we're going to get down and dig in and then splash water up onto the sides, and that's what reveals the crystals. And then we're gonna take home everything that we find today, which is super awesome. We're out here a little bit later in the afternoon. They are open from sunrise to sunset. So we're going to see how much we can find before dark. Okay, I was just inspecting the pile and I found these. They might not look like much right now, but when we clean them off, they're pretty awesome. This is a selenite crystal and this is what we're looking for. Oh, they were just regular salt. Okay, Dad's rinsing that off for me. And then you can see it. Look, so this... This is what we're looking at right here. We'll clean them up a little bit more after we're finished, but let's keep looking. I think I found something big. I don't know what this is. This might just be rock. What do you think it is? That's, that's like a rock. Oh my gosh, I feel the corner. Okay, update guys. We have been uncovering this hole right here and this is just a hole somebody else had started digging into but they really had no idea what that they were missing out on because we found like a little shelf kind of where dad's digging right now and we brought some water over so that we could splash it up on the sides and now he's uh finding a lot of stuff there's some treasures in here okay this is what we already have found and pulled out we haven't roused them up yet but this is water and we'll dump it over this is our start and then dad is about to add some water to right here and then we're hoping to pull out a really big one let's let's cross our fingers Let me get some more okay so see what he's kind of doing he's funneling it down and then as he does that it reveals the crystals that are sitting there and kind of pulls it away and there is a big cluster right there look at that 
Yes! This is awesome. It's like treasure hunting, guys. So right there, those those are the crystals. Right there. Look at this. Oh! Look at that. As it drains down, it reveals even more of them. Okay guys, so we spent a couple of good hours out here and we found quite a few. We're gonna have to wash them up and then I'll show you what they look like. Um, definitely a good day today. Uh, we found several of these and these are the hourglass shaped ones. We didn't find as many clusters as we did the last time, but we found tons of these and we hit like that vein as we were going and it was crazy. But now guys, it's about time for us to head out so we can go get them cleaned up and then I'll show you what they look like. Again, great way to spend a day here in Oklahoma, absolutely free of charge and you can take with you everything thing that you find so definitely recommend coming out to the great salt plains but uh let me go clean up those crystals so this was our hole after it was all said and done you can see we have dirt everywhere but we found several veins that were kind of running around this and this is about how deep they were now we have to leave but there are still some left in here so whoever gets here tomorrow or the day after all they have to do is splash some water and they're gonna find some true gems we would have stayed here longer but as you can see the sun is setting on us today and it is open from sunrise to sunset but that is the end of day Okay, we ended up with these. So, those all look nice, right? But look at these! We just got them all rinsed off and we're letting them dry so that we can take them and do some cool stuff with them. There you go. Tons of them. I do think this one might be one of my favorites though. It is almost perfect. Got to get all of the salt off of the van now. Look at that. Dad's getting it all off the underside and the tires. Yep, definitely have to do that when you leave the salt plains. 